Hi everyone, welcome to B Wong's flying tutorial for heroes and generals, and today we'll be covering the keyboard cam controls. So in the before video, I showed you uh, the key bindings and how to set them to fly customized for my deb debug controls, and now I'm going to demonstrate uh, how I place my hands and how I move and how we fly the plane with keyboard cam available. So hopefully you'll be able to see the keyboard as clearly as I can get it to, and let's get started. So. Um, when I place my my middle finger, and not flipping you guys off, on W and S, and they they switch depending if I want to use S or W. Um, my index finger is on D. My ring finger is on A. My pinky is gonna be holding that shift button the whole time to activate the debug when I need it. You always like ninety percent in the air, and then on the ground sometimes, and sometimes not. And then my thumb going to be on alt and space and they're going to alternate okay now just to review everything of uh, the key bindings so my pinky is on shift shift activates debug so it's going to be pressing it the whole time when i fly okay the whole time um alt right here that i set is going to be my orbit or free look so a free look I look around my plane and it activates that then i use my mouse to see around me so this activates free look and then space bars for dropping our bomb. Okay. And the WASD when you have debug activated, gonna control your plane moving up, down, tilt left, tilt right, and then you'll have to combine some of those keys to actually turn. So let's get a plane in. Hopefully we don't get attacked. Since it is a triple battle, there's gonna be a lot of planes possibly. Um we're just gonna fly high in the air. So I'm just gonna start with debug first. I'm gonna pull S to go up. Um, just want to tell everyone who's new to flying, or if they didn't know, uh, every time you pull up, every time you pull up in a plane, you will always uh, decelerate your speed. So, you see that white bar with the arrow? See how it's depleting? That means I'm, I'm losing my speed. Okay. Um, if I dive for a little bit, let's dive, you'll see the white bar increase because I'm going with gravity, so I'm increasing accelerating my speed okay now we're gonna fly a little bit higher um just so we can avoid all the other planes and just so we can get um all the demonstrations for the maneuvers simple controls now i'm flying the so i'm gonna activate let's say the free look okay so alt right here on the cam hold that down and then i'll use my mouse to look around and this is free look now the point about free look is that you're able to see everything see everything around you see everything around your plane and it doesn't matter if you have in fixed third person or first fixed um once you activate it you can actually see around you so it's good to see enemies uh friendlies uh for reference of where you are to the map um it's always always good all right so i think we're high enough i'm just gonna go to fixed third because i think that's probably the easiest for most of you so i still have my shift button if i want to control so let's do Let's go uh, up a bit, so we have shift and S, let's demonstrate that again. Going up, just tap a little bit however you, how high you want to angle it. If we want to dive down, we press shift, shift W. Okay, pretty simple, right? Well, let's center our plane a little bit. Let's do a right turn, okay? So if I want to do a right turn, there's two ways of doing it. Let's do the simple right turn. So we're going to go D to tilt it on its right side, and then you want to pull on S, or press S to pull it. Turn. Nice, half turn, and then we want to center it, right? So we're going to press A to tilt it on our left side, and bam, we're there. Now let's let's change it. Let's do let's do a left turn. Okay, so we still have our shift button pressed. We're going to use a ring finger on A, to turn tilt it on its left side, and to turn it left, we hold S. There you go. Turn it. Now let's do, and we recenter with D, because we're leading on our D. Okay, now let's recenter, and let's do a reverse turn, I guess you could say. So reverse right turn would be press D to tilt first, and then you want to reverse that turn. Instead of going up, we're moving to our right like we did before, we're going to do the opposite. We're going to press W, and pull downward, doing kind of a reverse turn. Now let's reset, press A to tilt back, there you go. And, and the great thing about this video guys is that you can always rewind it 
and go back and you can just go through this tutorial with me and just follow my instructions as we fly and once you feel comfortable eventually you can just play around and feel and get used to it and uh and that's the most important thing flying getting used to your controls is the most important thing after that you'll be able to advance and use free look and fly around but we'll do that in a more advanced video okay let's do a reverse uh left turn okay so let's shift and a tilt halfway there you go we're going to press w again so we're going to pull downwards right on the plane okay pretty simple right Let's do a basic maneuver. Let's say we want to make it difficult for someone to shoot us. Uh, we're going to do a barrel roll. Let's do a barrel roll to our right. So we just have shift and hold D. Bam. Z barrel roll. Now you just hold all the way around. There you go. Alright. And the last thing to cover is just bombing. So I have my base bar here. And if I want to drop a bomb. There you go. And you get two in all the recon planes. So once you've learned your basic controls in fixed position or in first position, however you feel comfortable, um, the next step is to be able to fly in free look. And if you're able to fly in free look, you're almost there becoming a great pilot. Because uh, if you're always flying in, say, first or fixed position, you're very limited to what you can see. And it'll be very, you'll be easy target for uh, most enemy pilots or tanks, AA. You, you need to use your free look. I mean, when you start off, just kind of click it for a little bit just to see, and you can reset to your fixed camera position. But eventually, you'll learn how to fly in free look like 90% like of the time. And then when you need to shoot, you'll just shoot like in fixed position. So how I fly, personally, is I like it in fixed because that's how I like to bomb and shoot. Um, and that's what I'm used to. And then I use free look most of the time to look around. Now... We're going to switch over to the mouse cam to demonstrate how I move with the mouse and their controls, and we're going to focus on throttle speed. Alright, so good luck, and I'll see you at the next one.